down when I'm pulling up. Come around when I'm pulling up. In my town and I'm pulling Hey, what's up guys? Henry the Blaze Jr. And as you can see in front of you today, we've got a Hall of Famer card once again. That being 95 overall, Diamond Richie Guerin. I want to say Richie Guerin. I'm going to go with Richie Guerin. I've never really heard of this player before up until today. He is a new card to the My Team community. He has not been here in previous years as far as I've known. I've never heard of him up until this year. And that's probably more because he has a Diamond card than anything. But uh, yeah, I've been hearing a lot of good things about this card. His stats look really good on paper when I was first looking at him. So today i'm gonna to be bringing you guys a gameplay and see if he is worth the price that he's going for so let's dive into these stats man and then we'll go into a game so as you guys can see 99 offensive and defensive overall for a diamond card should look like good news for you off the bat he is 6 4 at the shooting guard position though so we are going to be running him at point guard for this gameplay and diving into the stats here man he's looking good 97 driving layup 85 post fadeaway which is really nice 97 draw foul 98 down the line on the mid range 97 down the line on the three-pointer beautiful man 95 free throw as well and he's even got a 90 driving and contact dunk with the tendencies man so he's looking pretty good he has the potential to be the next rex chapman 2.0 with these kind of stats man but as we continue to go down you can see 90 ball control looks good the passing's not too bad at all his defense is phenomenal man 95 shot contest and steal with a 75 block he low-key has some rebounding nothing i would really trust 97 7 speed and acceleration 96 speed with ball 95 vertical like this card is looking insane 97 lateral quickness and then everything on the defensive end is in the mid 90s other than his low post defense like all around man this card really does look like he's gonna be a god it'll really just come down to what kind of animations he has but this card again really has the chance to be the next rex chapman 2.0 i say 2.0 because this richie actually has defense whereas the rex didn't really have defense but top to bottom on paper he's looking good so far and it only gets better man seven hall of fame badges including relentless teardropper mid-range deadeye acrobat catch and shoot everybody's favorite limitless range and difficult shots as well if this card had hall of fame tireless score man it would be a gg now he does have the gold tireless score gold deep range on defensive stopper and posterizer as well for some name worthy gold badges he's actually got a lot of good gold badges here all around man again this this card is looking really good but will he translate these stats and badges onto the court well guys it's time to find out Richie Guerin I have no idea who you are but maybe after today's game I'm gonna remember you forever without further ado let's hop into a game and let's see what this man's got alrighty our matchup for today is looking like a uh, pink diamond t-mac clay Kevin Durant Carl Malone and Bill Russell that's not Billy Ray Cyrus but you know what Let's go, cowboy. Bruh. Nice rebound there, Durant. All right, let's get it going. Straight to T-Mac. T-Mac to boom. Pump fake. All the way to the rim. I hear he's got the driving dunk. He's not using it, but we finishing a tough layup to start the game. Nice steal there. Let's go straight to Balake. Anyone running for an alley-oop? I see you, T-Mac. Don't even worry about it. So, unfortunately, we are going to be playing an off-baller for this video. You got T-Mac and you're off-balling. It's cool, though. Catch and shoot from our boy, Green Bean. That jumper is beautiful, man. Uh, let's play the pick and roll here. Hit that screen real quick. I'm snatching back. Oh, rolling to Shaq. Oh, he's in the post. This is Bill Russell. Bill, I know you're a good defender, but you're just so short, man. Is he playing any on-ball now? He's still not playing any on-ball defense, man. That's so boring. This is a 6-4 card. We're going all the way. Let's see that driving dunk. We draw the foul instead, and we're going to shoot some free throws. How are you going to off-ball with a 6-8 T-Mac? But again, people have done worse to me. They've off-balled with, like, Shaq at point guard. So you know what? I'm not really surprised anymore. Both free throws here. They're going down at a 95. Great rating for a diamond card. This card has to be a pink diamond, man. Nice rebound there, Shaq. Let's keep pushing the pace. Balake, I see you. Ah, uh, Richie, I see you. Limitless range. Bang! Nice rebound there by Blake. I know Richie's got the takeover, so just run, and I'ma feed you. Catch and shoot. Oh, he's moving. Green bean. Yo, this card's hooping right now, especially against this off-baller. The only flaw I can really think of to this card right now is his height. He's playing great on defense. On the offensive end, he's nice. We haven't really seen any dunks yet, but he's playing good. Right there, he hits the shot, but you know what? I'm not worried. 0.9 seconds. That's too much time for Richie. Good. Never mind. All right, started the second quarter. Let's get it going. Oh, Richie, I see you. You're too open. Where's the defense? Green to start us off. Yo, that jumper, it's really nice. Give me that ball. Thank you. Go to T-Mac. Oh, T-Mac in transition. Psych, let me go to Blake. Easy dunk. 
Uh, let's go right to T-Mac. You can try to trail. It's not going to work because now Richie's in front of you. We're blowing by to the rim. Let's finally see a dunk. No, we're drawing another foul. No and one, but we will get some free throws. I'm going to try to go to the rim a little bit just so I can show you guys what his dunk package looks like. But so far, he's playing great. That was just kind of unfortunate. I think I was leaning my stick a little too much to the right there. Uh, second one here, though. It's going to go down. It's going to give him his 20 points. Richie, let's run you a quick ISO. He's actually on balling you. Cross up, snatch back. Oh, get finessed. Easy threes once again. I want to dunk, but when this man gives me too much space, I got to take it. Thank you. I'll take that. Uh, let's go to Balake. Slow that down. Go this way. Richie's wide open. Easy mid range and easy money. One thing I do want to do, like I said earlier, is go for the dunks, but this guy's literally off balling me to death, and I can't get to the rim with him standing under the rim with Shaq. All right, off to T-Mac. You can try to off all that. All you want, catch and shoot from Limitless. Bang! Yo! Oh, my goodness. I don't know what to say anymore. Good defense. Good defense. Good defense. Good. Look at that defense. Look at that defense. Give me the ball. We're going to T-Mac. Then I'm firing back to Richie. Catch and shoot. Bang! We got eight seconds here and he's running the off ball, but we got the deodorant for that. Get running, Richie. Right around the screen. Oh, there is no screen. We're shooting from deep though, and we're not missing. <laughs> and just like that, guys, our opponent has left the match. We had 40 points in the first half, and he was just getting exposed with that off ball. It was not working out. Now, obviously, this one game's not going to be enough. So let's go ahead. Let's hop into another one, and let's see what this Rex Chapman 2.0 has really got. Let's get into it. All right, on to matchup number two, and it's looking like Magic Johnson, T-Mac once again, Kawhi Leonard, Amethyst, Anthony Davis, and Greg Oden. Okay, Kim Finn 99 if you ever see this video, sell T-Mac and make this lineup look a little nicer. I don't care if he's your favorite player. You having Am Amethyst, Anthony Davis as a starter, it's just not going to work out. Let's go to Richie. He's playing on-ball defense, so I respect it. Going to the rim, not dunking it, but we're getting a layup to start the game. All right, T-Mac, let's go right to my boy Rexy 2.0, and we crossing up, snatch back. Oh, I should have gone to the rim on that note. Go to the rim now, not drawing a foul, and one! I was going to say drawing a foul. I don't know why I said not drawing a foul. It was more that I didn't dunk, but you know what? <laughs> you do your thing, Rexy 2.0. Uh, free throw here, going down. He's got a quick five points. Nice rebound there. All right, let's push the pace. Straight to Balake. Rexy, don't worry. I see you. Catch. Pump fake. Go to the rim this time, and No dunk or layup. I don't know why I went to a crowd, man. That was dumb. Cross up. Oh, I'm going middle. All the way to the rim. Finally, we're still not going to dunk. Okay, I'm trying too much to dunk. Richie's getting cold. I'm probably shooting terribly from the field, so we're just going to let it happen. I can't force dunks anymore. First free throw here is going down. You can see I'm two for six from the field, and that's all from just trying to run at the rim. Both free throws here not even going down. This is tough. Let's go there. Let's go back to Richie. I don't know why you're going under the basket, but you know what? Let's test out that fadeaway green. Uh, let's go to Blake. Blake to Richie. Let's get a pick and roll going this time. Get around that screen and push back. Limitless me, baby. Bang! Back to his thing. Yes, the three's going down. Uh, let's go right to T-Mac. Let's start cooking him up this quarter, man. No more playing around. Richie, open again. Boom, baby. Nice rebound there. Let's end this quarter. Six seconds to go. T-Mac to who? Richie. Pump fake. Slash through. Oh, I see Blake in the corner. Give me that assist. Oh, hey. He had a terrible animation there. I was like, I hate it when they gave me those animations when I got the time to hit the buzzer beater. But you know what? Hall of Fame catch and shoot, baby. Richie, you will get a dunk this game. Oh, we've blown by. Get out of my way, Lillard. Finally, there you go. He's got that nice reverse dunk to get his first dunk of these two game plays. Ah. Uh, Cross up, behind the back. Oh, easy lane to the basket once again. Not getting a dunk there, but we get the contested layup. Yo, they're closing out on him every time he drives to the rim. All right, I'm letting this guy come back a little too much. So, Richie, keep, go back to doing your thing, man. The transition three for him is actually kind of insane. I don't know what it is about that jumper, but moving and catch and shoot, they're both perfect. Get that. There we go. All right, let's push it. We haven't scored much this quarter, so let's get something going. Oh, Blake's running. I got to feed him. Catch that dunk. Oh, wow, that was nice. Uh, let's go straight to T-Mac. T-Mac trailing Richie. Catch. Pump. Oh, it's too deep for limit. Let's. Oh, back to T-Mac. Easy threes right there. Easy money. All right. So we were fooling around a little too much in that second quarter. There shot like five for thirteen. So let's get it going this time. Getting the ball all the way to the rim. This time he's. Oh, I thought he was gonna put it between the legs, but nice dunk to get us started. Get that rebound. We got D-Rob in here. D-Rob. Let's run it to Blake. To T-Mac. T-Mac to Richie. 
to Blake. We blow him by. Oh, we're going all the way on that one. Hindi goes for a soft layup. What are you doing, guys? Let's go there. Oh, he's wide open. Out to D-Rob for three. He's got that, baby. He's got that. This D-Rob is so nice. I'm low-key thinking of giving him a three-point shoot. All right, so we've been playing a little dumb, taking some dumb shots with Richie, but now it's time to get him going. Get open, Richie. Catch and shoot. Easy jumper. Easy money. It's time to get that takeover. Uh, let's go to Vince. I see a trailing Richie who's running literally right behind me. Catch. Pump fake. Drive through. Oh, where these open? Catch and shoot, baby. Easy assist. Easy money. Let's get him in the post. Get him in the post. There we go. Got him. And finesse there. Easy animation. Easy bucket. Uh, let's go straight to Vince. We have been shooting terribly this second half as well. Oh my god, the leg is insane. Uh, let's go to a nice little ISO here. Cross up. Step back. Oh, it's an open three. Give it to me, baby. Bang! Good defense right there. He's not hitting that shot. All right, let's get this quarter going. Because I realize this has been one of the most low-scoring games I've ever played. Richie, get cooking for me, please. Thank you. Nice rebound there. All right, let's push it, man. We're going to get a nice little lead here. We're only up three, but you know what? We're about to be up ten in a second. I'm open again. I'm pulling it. Green bean. Let's get a run going. I'm done playing around. I realize I've been playing really stupid this whole game. So let's smarten up. All right, a minute and a half to go. Not too much score. Oh, man. Ankle breaker right there. I should have taken it right there, but around the screen is a lot easier. Catch and shoot. Easy threes. Easy money. Nice rebound there. Richie and takeover. I want to test your range. Catch and shoot from deep, baby. Bang. Now we're going off. I should have been playing smarter from the beginning, but I honestly think this guy would have rage quit. Just like I think he's about to rage quit right now. With a minute to go once again, a person is going to rage quit. I just don't get why people do this, man. Yep, just like that, your opponent has left the match. Well, it was fun while it lasted, but honestly, that game was low-key boring with the opponent. He wasn't really the greatest opponent, so it didn't really push me to try the hardest. But let's hop back into the main menu, and let's talk a little bit more about this Richie Garen. All right, so guys, unfortunately, with a man rage quitting there at the end of the fourth quarter, we are not going to be getting to see the stat line of that game. But man, this Richie Guerin is a hooper. At first, when I saw this card, I saw his stats, and I thought they were really nice. But obviously, when you see a historic card and you see their stats, you can't bite into it too quick. Luckily, this Richie Guerin, man, he is an absolute hooper. I don't know who you are, but you are now the Rex Chapman 2.0 of 2K19. This card is nothing but dominant. He's going to be able to play a lot of cards that are way better than him in terms of tiers pink diamonds galaxy opals he just might be able to compete now given that he is only 6'4 obviously he's not gonna be able to like guard cards like Karolinko and stuff but he is still going to be a great point guard man he can really play great defense his shooting is phenomenal and he's got one of the easiest releases I've ever seen and it is super consistent he can go to the rim he's got nice dribbles like there's really nothing wrong about this card other than his height and this height again is not that bad 6'4 for those of you that do like to run like a traditional guard for the most part run Richie at the point guard position you can run him at shooting guard but i don't think you'll really utilize him the most out of there if you run him at point guard i think you will really get the most out of this card but go pick this man up i can now see why he's going for the price that he's going for and i think that once these packs are out he's only gonna go up in price again this man is the rex chapman 2.0 of 2k19 and you do not want to be missing out on a card so dominant he easily plays like a pink diamond no question about it looking at him with a diamond wrapper should not make you think he's not going to make my lineup because he's a diamond because this card he is an absolute god again i don't know who you are all i know is that you played for the new york knicks but i am glad you have come to my team this year hopefully you continue being a dominant budget card for everyone for the rest of the year but uh this is going to be the end of the video guys so as always if you did enjoy the video don't forget to leave a like and for you new viewers you know you gotta hit the subscribe Blah. what i meant to say was for you new viewers you know you gotta hit that subscribe button and join the blazer nation i want to thank you guys for watching i hope you all have an awesome day and take care